What's up, Future Fighters? We are back. This is video number seven in uh, today's series on the uh, counter control, really, is what we came to. And these are all the videos that are going to be coming out um, on this and also last week's series. We'll get back to the website here in a little bit. Uh, but what we have done today, just as a little overview, is we took, we, we analyzed defense, uh, the AI's defense in conjunction with the AI offense, and we concluded that definitely need different scripts. And there's nowhere more telling than, than this area, and you can read this note here um, to find out uh, exactly why, and that's, I wrote it in the last video, so you can go to the last video if you want to read that that whole note. And what we need now here is a script counter control. And that will allow us to choose um, to stay, to, uh, the transition types stay in for counter. So the stay in transition types, which are defined originally here in strike control. And that's case zero, uh, transition position. Um, you have a, a extendable access here. Uh, they are extendable, combos are extendable. And then of course, um, that will actually be, that'll actually be the only one actually. It'll just be, a set of stay in. So we actually might not need a full combo, full full complement because, and the reason is because this transition position, so back them off, not extendable. We don't want those. Um, we want things that are extendable. Back them out, stay out, that's not extendable. Uh, and then back them off, pressure forward and, and stay in. Actually, this one actually would work as well. Um, and the reason it would work, and I'm going to show you that, is because, remember, we just got hit, so we went into strike control, into defense, and we did a counter. Now, we could, um, we could perform a move, a chase down move like that, which is, that's transition type 3. We could perform, uh, we could put moves in like that, in counter, and... Um, and that might be fun to do. We just want to make sure that we're not overriding the end combo sequence's ability um, to uh, extend combos. So the way to do that, the way to check that is just to go into uh, strike control currently and look at what move is in case three and go th let's we'll go over that move and um, and see how it looks. So we can do that. So go over that move. Uh, I'll put that in our in our notes so we know. Let me create script. Oh, let me show you so you can see a script counter control set to Choose zero or three. Review. Strike control. To this end. Great. Those are good notes there. And once we've decided on how we're going to do that, then we will have to look at this area of the code and see if the counter control will apply here. And then, of course, we have our list that we're working through. This is our short-term list that we're working through. Um, and let's see here. And we have some work to do in choose offense, which is going to be really fun. Uh, and then we're going to be getting into making new moves for Shadow AI to control Omega, 
to control uh, the Omanyte. And then, of course, is um, motion capture next character, Rissa. You guys are going to like her. She is cool. She is cool. That's her. So that's where we're headed. I really hope that you have enjoyed uh, this series. And um, today we're going to get back into it in the next set of videos. So uh, before we do that, and let me, I think I when I minimize everything, let me see. There we go. Sorry. Video froze there for a minute. Before we do that, go to DocBrockGames.com and check out the alpha version of the game. You can check out the features I currently have in the game, the two characters that I currently have motion captured that are in the game, those features, characters, and motion captured moves in action in the game, and then put your email address in at the bottom, and I'll let you know when that game actually comes out. Then back to YouTube for us, because we got more AI to make. I'll see you next time.